These 22nd ECC engineers are prepping materials for a day of doing what these types of engineers do. Blowing stuff up. For some, like specialist Talib Scott, it's training he's familiar with after having already deployed with the unit. I was in a demo truck and I know almost everything about them. Just have to get certified on it now. For others, who have yet to head downrange, it's a chance to get some experience with their soldiers and the equipment. For me, it's just another one of the many examples of training events that give me confidence in my soldiers and my NCOs and show me that they, they know what they're doing, they've been there before, they're professionals, and we're going to be able to get the job done when we get downrange. It's a full day for these engineers, learning how to properly prepare and emplace various types of demo and charges, starting with basic blocks of C4 and detonation cord for a confidence exercise, all the way up to larger forms of explosions using shape and cratering charges. After one charge misfires, a vehicle called a buffalo moves out to perform a blow in place or BIP, something that downrange can make for an exciting part of the job, but... It's also the worst part of the job. Like, it, it, it doesn't get exciting until it goes bad. Like a, like a good day is a boring day, downrange. After a long day of buildup, they finally get to an equal payoff. For the Rainier Report, I'm Army Sergeant Nate Bowen.